computer science videos here today to show you guys in this tutorial how to create a fixed navigation menu using HTML5 and CSS3. Without further ado, let us start the video. So in this tutorial, you need to have access to a Mac computer, the software itself, which is text edit. So we can now go all the way down to the dock, go to launch path, search for the application, text edit, click on this, command S to save. Go to the desktop, start a new folder, call this fixed menu, create, change the text edit file name to index.htm, save, yes, use.htm, increase the size of the text edit file, increase the font size, command plus a couple of times, and now we are ready to start the programming in HTML5 and CSS3 to create a fixed menu. Less than exclamation mark doc type in capitals HTML greater than less than HTML greater than less than slash HTML greater than. In this, we now need the head and body. body less than slash body greater than within head we can have title if required to but not for this tutorial go into the body and now start programming the html5 less than div class equals speech marks nav bar greater than new line Less than a h ref equals speech marks hashtag home greater than home less than slash a greater than highlight the last line of code copy paste a couple of more times after we indent and then change home to news and contact likewise on the right hand side. And then end with a div tag less than slash div greater than go to a new line again less than div class equals main go to a new line again insert a heading less than h1 greater than a fixed menu less than slash h1 greater than we can have more headings such as scroll now the navigation menu will be fixed add some more text in the form of paragraphs if required to less than p greater than some text on screen less than slash p Greater than, highlight the previous line of code, copy and then paste a couple of more times. Highlight again, copy, paste. And so this will be helpful when it comes to executing, scrolling to see the text on screen, what happens with the navigation bar, it's fixed, and the text will go under the navigation bar as the navigation bar will never move due to its fixed positioning. Go all the way to the top within head. We now need the CSS3 less than style greater than less than slash style. Within style, insert all the CSS body curly brace margin colon zero semicolon curly brace new line dot nav bar curly brace new line overflow background color position top width go back to the top after overflow colon highlight copy and paste at the end of each word go to background color ignore the spelling go back to overflow hidden semicolon background color hashtag triple three 
Semicolon, position fixed for a reason. Semicolon, top, zero, semicolon, width, 100%. Semicolon, new line, curly brace. Command S to save, go to a new line again. Navbar, dot, navbar, A. Curly brace, new line, indent, float, display, color, text align, padding, text decoration, font size. Go back to the top again, float, colon, highlight, copy and paste at the end of each word. Go back to the top again, float to the left, semicolon, display, block, semicolon, color, hashtag F2 three times, semicolon, text align to the center, semicolon, padding, 14 pixels, 16 pixels, semicolon, text decoration, none, semicolon, font size, 17 pixels, semicolon, go to a new line, curly brace. Dot nav bar a colon hover curly brace new line background and color go back to background colon copy paste at the end of color as well go back to background again triple d in hashtag semicolon color black Semicolon, new line, curly brace, highlight color. Ignore the spelling, go to a new line again. Dot main, curly brace, new line. Padding, margin top, height. Go back to the top, padding, colon, highlight, copy and paste at the end of each word. Go back to padding again, 16 pixels. Semicolon, margin top, 30 pixels. Semicolon, height. 1,500 pixels, semicolon, new line, curly brace, command S to save. The reason why we have height 1,500 pixels to enable the scrolling. So the programming itself in HTML5 or CSS3 is done, command S to save. Now we can go all the way down to the dock, go to finder, desktop, fixed menu, index.html, open with Safari, decrease the size, of the web browser, minimize finder, decrease the size of the text edit file, and now go to the web browser, right click, reload the page, scroll up, scroll down. We have a fixed menu created with HTML5 and CSS3 with some links. The navigation bar itself is fixed to the screen. We scroll up, the text disappears, we scroll down, the text reappears. Quit Safari, quit text edit, that's it for this video, I'll see you guys in my next tutorial, thanks for now.